So for this example, we will be getting the parts of the given parabola given by the equation squared quantity of y minus 3 is equal to 4 times the quantity of x plus 2. So this follows this standard form wherein the opening of this parabola is to the right. So this would be facing to the right. From this setup, we can say that the parabola is facing to the right if the squared variable is y and 4c here is positive. So let us have that 4c is equal to 4 in reference to this given equation. Now, let us identify some parts. We have the vertex, focus, directrix, axis of symmetry, and endpoints of the lattice rectum. From our given equation here, that can be written as, to follow the standard form, this would be y minus 3 squared is equal to 4 times the quantity of x minus, and that would be negative 2. So as you can see here, this would be x plus 2. So if we will follow this format, it would be written as x minus negative 2. So that you would see that the vertex would be at hk, and that would be negative 2 positive 3. So for our vertex here, this would be negative 2, positive 3. Remember that the value with x would be our h and the value with y would be our k. So for our focus, again, we will refer to our 4c and we need to get the value of c. So for that one, we will divide both sides by 4 so that we can have this as 4 over 4 and that is 1. Therefore, our focus is one unit away from our vertex and that is to the right of our vertex. So let's try to sketch our graph here. So our vertex is at negative 2 and then I have positive 3. So let's say here is 3. So we can say that this would be our vertex. So if our parabola is opening to the right, our focus would be to the right of our vertex and that would be one unit. If that is the case, the focus is at negative 1, positive 3. So this is our focus. So let's have this at negative 1, positive 3. Three. Now, the directrix is perpendicular to our x-axis for parabola that is facing to the right. So that would be if our focus is to the right of our vertex, then the directrix would be one unit to the left of our vertex. So that would be at negative 3. So let's say here is negative 3. So that would be a vertical line that passes through negative 3. So since this is a line and this is perpendicular to our x-axis, therefore, the equation of the directrix is x is equal to negative 3. And for the axis of symmetry, it passes through our vertex and the focus and that is perpendicular to our y-axis. And therefore, the equation of our axis of symmetry would be y is equal to 3. So for the endpoints of the lattice rectum, we will refer to our 4c here and that would be 4. So divided by 2, so that would be 4 over 2 is 2. Therefore, we would be having 2 units north of our focus and two units south of our focus. So that would be 5. Here is one endpoint and another two units would be at 1. So that would be our another endpoint. So the endpoints would be at negative 1, 5, and negative 1, 1. And then to give you the rough sketch of our graph, 
from our vertex we can have this and here 